in a recent dissenting opinion that you wrote, you said there was, quote, no question, end quote, that, quote, keeping guns out of the hands of those who are likely to misuse them, quote, is, quote, a very strong governmental interest. Do you stand by that statement? I can't remember precisely the words of Cantor, which is the case in which I dissented, which That's I think That's correct, Cantor B. Barr. Cantor B. Barr. Um, what I said in that opinion, I stand by, which is that the original meaning of the Second Amendment, and I went through a lot of detailed history in that case, does support the idea that governments are free to keep guns out of the hands of the dangerous. So for example, the mentally ill, others who would be likely to misuse guns. If you could be more specific in any way with respect how you would view your place on the court with respect to controlling weapons in this country. Um, I think what I can say is that my opinion in Cantor shows how I approach questions as a matter of judicial philosophy. I mean, I, I spent a lot of time in that opinion looking at the history of the Second Amendment and looking at the Supreme Court's cases. And so the way in which I would approach um, the review of gun regulation is in that same way, to look very carefully at the text, to look carefully at what the original meaning was. That, that was the method that both the majority and dissent in Heller took. So I promised that I would come to that with an open mind, um, applying the law as I could best determine it. Thanks so much for watching Bloomberg Quick Take News, where we bring you the biggest stories the moment they happen from around the world. Don't forget to click the video if you want to see more of our latest coverage and subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take News to get insight in an instant.